Hi, friends in the Upper Valley. This is Ryan Page, um, and I have a quick announcement for you. As of this week, I have made the decision to step away from my position as the community organizer in the Upper Valley for Vermont Interfaith Action. Um, it has been more than amicable. I had long conversations with Debbie, with the whole staff there. Um, this is a decision that we're making for our family. Um, a personal decision to step away here. The work is amazing. We believe in the mission, the vision, everything, all of the work that's been going on and has been going on and will continue to go on. Um, and we look forward to staying adjacent to it and being a part of it however we can, just not in an official capacity. And I wanted to make sure that you guys knew that um, and got to see me here. And so for those of you I haven't talked to, um, this is the announcement. I'm not going to be the organizer paid anymore. I look forward to finding ways to stay connected with you over time. Um, but I do have some good news. Um, there's a quite a few good news is actually that come out of this. And the first bit of good news is that there was already a seasoned organizer in place for the Upper Valley to continue and expand the work that has been going on. His name is Mike Mrowicki, and I would like to introduce him to you now. Hey, everybody in the Upper Valley. This is Mike Merwicki. He is going to be taking over the work here in the Upper Valley. Um, he's been on staff with VIA for a uh, little more than a year now, I think. Is that right? Um, but he's been doing good work for social change in Vermont for a lot longer than that. So I would love to give him a chance to just quickly introduce himself and um, have you get to know him a little bit so that you can get to know each other really well over the next couple of months. Um, Mike, Thanks for thanks for taking over this work and doing the continuing the good work you've been doing already. Tell us about yourself and what you uh, y your family, your work here in Vermont, um, your work with VIA, all that stuff. Sure. Well, well, thank you so much, Ryan. And and first of all, thank you for the good work that you've been doing and and um, an extended welcome to Vermont. Uh, it, it's great that you and your family have chosen Vermont and. Uh, how long has it been? Two years? We now? moved here two years ago, almost exactly, almost exactly two years ago. And it's been amazing. Well, we're, we are really loving having you here. And it's been wonderful to get to know you a little bit. And I can tell you a little bit about myself to the people out there now. And my name is Mike Merwicki. Uh, I live in Putney, Vermont. I live in the what I call the Southeast Kingdom of Vermont, where we border New Hampshire and in Massachusetts, down along the Connecticut River Valley. So we have that in common. And uh, I've been working for VIA for a little over a year now. And uh, I've been covering actually the district known as the Wyndham Bennington District. But when we, we found out Ryan was gonna be uh, moving on to some other things to do in his life, we wanted to make sure that the Upper Valley was covered and we wanted to keep the work going. So that's why we're going to do a little shifting here, and, and my district will now become the Wyndham and Windsor uh, district, and tips into the the orange area as well a little bit, I think. So uh, I have been here in Vermont for for forty years now, and uh, and I've been uh, part of, as I said, part of our communities. Uh, in lots of different ways. Uh, it's a, the, one of the reasons I moved to Vermont was because I wanted to be part of communities. And um, tell you a little bit about my spiritual background now, because works and faith have always been an essential part of what, well, of my being within faith communities. And uh, I've been a member of the Putney Quaker meeting for over 30 years now. And one of the things that attracted me to Quakers was how many of them I could see putting their faith into action. That it wasn't it wasn't enough just to go to church on Sunday, but it was how we lived our lives, how we were uh, doing the work that we think we're called to do. And I, I tell the story of uh, this, this young preschooler who came out of Sunday school once running into our worship meeting with this picture. And he says, look, mommy, I made God. And of course the child did because uh, we are in that image and we make the image ourselves, but we are the hands of God. We are the voice of God. It's our actions that bring God alive here on earth. And that's where for me, uh, 
it's not enough to go to church on Sunday. It's a, a nice warm place to go. It's an easy, it's a, it's that easy chair we want to sink into to refresh from the week. But uh, for me, uh, faith without action is, is not nearly as fulfilling as, as doing the work. So that's why working for VIA has been a, a wonderful way to, to bring that about. And, and I'm looking forward now to, to building on Ryan's connections and to make new connections. And I'm looking forward to, to getting to know the landscape and, and to build on what's been happening there for a long time, because it's evident uh, it's a very vibrant area. And um, I think it's going to make my work easy just to follow, follow in and, and, and help keep things going. So thanks, Ryan. Uh, I look forward to, to meeting people. Uh, my contact info, we'll try and put up on there. Uh, email is probably an easy way to, to get in touch. But I also have a phone number that might be as easy as any to remember in Vermont. It's 802-387-8787. And operators are standing by now to take your call. <laughs> so um, feel free to be in touch. Uh, and I am going to be looking forward in the new year to, to learning more, to meeting a lot of you and keeping the work going. So thank you for this opportunity and uh, hope you have a, a blessed Thanksgiving and holiday season and looking forward to meeting you all in the new year. Brilliant. Upper Valley, you are in good hands. Mike has been serving Vermont also as a representative uh, in the House of Vermont for, I think you just got reelected for your 16th or 16th cycle, 16th uh, term. This will be my ninth term. Ninth term, 16th year. That's right. You've been 16 years you've been in this. Congratulations. Um, that's exciting. Um, and uh, I look forward to continuing to see how the work here develops um, under your good leadership and your, and your hands. Um, As I'm sure you could tell, Mike is an incredible human and good a good organizer of people and a leader in the state of Vermont. And so he is going to bring incredible work for you. Um, he's a, a tremendous person to be able to connect with. Um, I'm going to pass on all of the information so that he can begin reaching out to you. Um, you'll have his contact information in this message, and you'll be able to reach out to him as well. Um, he looks forward to that. Um, phone number, email, whatever is going to be best for you all. Um, and, uh, and the second bit of good news is that we're not going anywhere. We chose Vermont two years ago. We moved here. VIA gave us the stepping stone to be here in Vermont and gave us, our family, the opportunity to relocate. And we really found home here in Vermont and here in this, uh, this beautiful community of the Upper Valley. Um, we are not going anywhere. We get to stay. We get to continue to put down roots. Our children are thriving. Our family is growing and thriving. And we are excited to remain in community here however we can. I wanted to say thank you. Thank you for what you have done for our family, for welcoming me, for being my friend, for introducing me to this wonderful places that are here in Vermont, in this Upper Valley area, um, and for being incredible people who are doing good work uh, and will continue to do good work. I know that you will thrive and grow to do, to do that in under Mike's leadership and in your continued partnership with Vermont Interfaith Action. Um, my email and phone number, my phone number is not changing. My email address um, is my personal email address now. Um, I'll make sure that you guys have that so you can reach out to me as well. Um, I look forward to staying updated and uh, I hope all is well. I hope this holiday season is amazing and I hope that uh, more good work continues and I get to celebrate along with you from the sidelines. Thank you in much love and peace. Be well.